Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another AWS Unlimited match. Today's match is a elimination, elimination chamber between two tag teams and Red Hulk was covering up Biff Tan's face. Anyway, today's match is between two tag teams, the big baddies with Bane, Red Hulk, and Biff Tannen, and the, dark, and the dark heroes with Batman, Spawn, and V. The dark heroes you may recognize from past AWS Unlimited matches. By the way, Spawn and V have settled their differences and have become become friends and joined Batman in a tag team, if you're wondering. Because last time you saw them, they were fighting each other. Also, today's match is brought to you by a Chamber POD Spear with Big Show and Shiamis. And also, because today's match is an Elimination Chamber, we don't have to deal with unga ungodly long entrances today. Yeah, we can just get straight to the match, which is awesome. I love that. We still have to deal with really, really long um, loading screens, though. Ser seriously, the these loading screens take longer than the entrances. Get on with it! I want to see the match! There we go. And we kick, kick off today's match with Batman doing a DDT to Red Hulk. Yeah, a normal, just a normal average everyday guy like Batman with some martial arts training just did a DDT to a giant mutated monster of a man. For those who don't know, Red Hulk is a, uh, well, basically, if you know the Hulk, you know that he's always got the military after him, and there's this general guy and everything, trying to, always trying to get him, General Ross. Well, this General Ross, uh, he became Red Hulk so that he could go toe-to-toe -to -toe with the Green Hulk, and so, yeah, that's the origin story of Red Hulk. Other than that, all you need to know is that he's a Hulk villain, and he's beating up Batman. Good, because Batman was beating him up earlier, so Batman kind of deserves that payback. And yes, last time you saw Batman, he was fighting Marty McFly. Batman's still a little pr pretty pissed off that Marty uh, beat him up. So he's trying to prove himself by going up against these three big buff guys and Biff Tannen, who's an enemy of Marty. Oh yeah, and uh, in comes Spawn, who's helping out Batman as one of the dark heroes. Last time you saw him, he was fighting V. And, ooh, team move on Red Hulk. Yeah, it makes more sense for Spawn to be beating up Red Hulk because Spawn's like this demon guy and wait why is he taller than red hulk red hulk should be like taller than him Jeez. wow red hulk is really not that threatening once you see him go toe-to-toe -to -toe with this version of spawn Jeez. are you sure are you sure red spawn isn't the hulk here pretty sure he is okay another person's coming into the ring hopefully it's someone from Red Hulk's team. If it's not, then Red Hulk. But if it's not, then Red Hulk is screwed, and he is screwed because V is coming in. Who last time you saw was fighting Spawn? Like I said, him and Spawn were fighting last time, but they decided to become friends because they thought, eh, them fighting was pretty stupid because they're pretty much both good guys. So they decided to join in a tag team and have Batman come along so they could help Batman become prove himself. Because last time, again, last time we saw Batman, he got his ass handed to him. By Marty. Anyway, there they, there they are kicking the Red Hulk's ass. It's not a good day for Red Hulk. I mean, Red Hulk's doing a pretty good job fighting back and everything, but these guys, he's up against three guys. And, yeah. I don't think Red Hulk's gonna make it make it out of this match alive. I mean, Batman and Batman doesn't kill people, but V and Spawn kill people, so... Yeah, he's not gonna make it out alive. And in comes a teammate from... Red Hulk's team, the big baddies. Wonder who it's gonna be? And it's Biff! If it was Bane, he'd have a better chance of surviving, but nope, and... Wait. Right, right when Biff comes in, Red Hulk gets eliminated. So now Biff is screwed. Because he's the least strong of the big baddies. Oh, jeez. This, this is not gonna be pretty... Ooh! Poor Biff. Spawn, are you... Aware... Oh. Was that a team move? I don't know what Spawn just did there. Anyway, well, so yeah, Biff, again, is doing a pretty good job trying to fight back, but he's up against three guys. One guy is a... Uh, all of them are pretty good in martial arts and everything, and Biff's just some school bully. Well, again, then again, he bullies Marty, and Marty beat Batman, so maybe Biff has a chance. And it doesn't seem like he does because he's getting his ass handed to him. Oh, looks like Bane's about to come in. Maybe Bane can help him out. 
two. Boom. And here comes Bane. Bane, that's right. Oh, oh yeah, I forgot to tell you some backstory about Biff. Biff is Marty McFly's enemy. He's the main villain of the Back to the Future movies, and he's pretty much a school bully. And Bane is a Batman villain who actually once broke Batman's back. Yeah. So now that Bane's in there, I actually do kind of have a little bit of faith in the big baddies winning this match. But I don't have complete faith because there's more of the Dark Heroes have all three of their members in, whereas Bane and Biff, it's just the two of them because Red Hulk sucked. Batman, are you aware that uh that uh if you had not have interrupted that pin, then that y you could have won because all you would have had left is Biff, Batman. You're an idiot. Now Bane's stop stepping on you. Oh wait, it, could Biff be eliminated? Nope. Biff stays in, and so does Bane. I feel bad for Bane right now. He he has two of the dark heroes going after him. Ooh. Poor Poor Bane. Things aren't going much better for Biff. I mean, looks, he's getting his ass handed to him by some demon guy. Now Batman's going over to help him out. Or he can go back to working on Bane. That's cool, too. Let's focus on Spawn and Biff. See how, see how he's doing. Biff's getting his ass handed to him. Why am I not surprised? And, oh, Bane just got thrown back into the ring very violently. But once, like the two others in the big baddies, Bane does a pretty good job fighting back. Say, he's not completely terrible, he just doesn't really have a good chance of winning because, like I said, there's more of the Dark Heroes in there than there are of the Big Baddies. A shame, I actually kind of wanted the Big Baddies to win because Bane's like one of my all-time favorite characters of DC. Oh, well, oh, he punches Batman in the face. Like we haven't seen that before. Oh, and a bulldog from Bane. What's Bane gonna do now? Oh, never. Bane does nothing because V does that. Oh, wait. Could V eliminate Bane? Nope. Biff saves him. Thank. Good job, Biff. Only now. Only Biff is now getting attacked by Spawn. Well, Spawn does not like Biff. I guess Spawn. I guess Spawn and Marty must be best friends. And you just punch nothing. But Spawn, don't. Stop it. Stop attacking your own teammates. Jeez. Oh, and there's Biff working on V. And V reversed him, and V did that to him. And now Bane's getting his ass handed to him by Spawn. This is not a good day for Bane, Biff, and Red Hulk. I mean, Red Hulk's the first one eliminated. Well, that's because the counter thing, decide to be a d douche to Red Hulk and have all three members come out before any of the other big baddies come out so that Red Hulk can get his ass kicked. Damn. It's like, this, it's like they want the Dark Heroes to win, which they most likely will. Yeah, I know. I said they will. They're probably going to win a million times in this video. I'm, I'm sorry. Oh, and there's Batman punching the crap out of Bane. You know, there's not enough punching in this Oh, and could he eliminate Bane? And oh, he does. No, Bane. You're my you're like one of my favorite Batman villains. You can't go. <laughs> and could they eliminate Biff? And they do. Dark. So not surprisingly, the Dark Heroes have won this match. Oh yeah, and I just realized it's the first time ever that a Batman character won. Well, actually no, Harley Quinn won the last match. Never mind, it's the second time a Batman character has won this match. And it was actually Batman himself. Batman has redeemed himself after fighting Marty. Well, then again, Batman only won this match because he had two people helping him out. But anyway, that was the that was the match, everyone. Hope I hope you enjoyed this edition of AWS Unlimited. I am your commentator, Super Zack Thunder. For AWS Chaos, go to Film Six's channel, link in the description. I will see you next Wednesday. Bye-bye.